What is going on guys? My name is Ron back in from Rom Reviews here with another episode reaction to ReZero season 2 episode I forgot, so it's episode 40, okay? <laughs> I don't remember what exact number in season 2. Uh, I think it's like, what, 15? 14? 15? One of those? But episode 40, Otto, Suwon, and A Reason to Believe. Now, we had the last episode, we have Otto basically confronting Garfield about the whole situation. I'm really curious as to what's going to happen with Best Girl uh, and, uh, and Garfield. <laughs> but this show still... Re finds a way to keep me asking the one question that has like basically defined the show what the fuck <laughs> and i've absolutely loved it but i'm ready to jump into this episode reaction i don't know what to expect i'm a little bit late to this i guess actually this is a technically normal time but i've actually been home for a little while but i've been sleeping just due to work but i'm not even gonna get into that why because it's reason zero i'm ready to jump into this episode reaction we have 27 and a half minutes of goodness not including the opening and ending probably but yeah I'm ready to jump into this episode. So, guys, without further ado, let us jump in to episode 40 of ReZero Season 2. Starting in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. <gasps> to keep you busy. Hmm. Oh, don't hurt Otto. <laughs> oh, he got the jewel. Is it when he got hit? But bug friends are insects. <laughs> there you go, Otto. Good shit. Good shit, Otto. Oh, we get his backstory. Okay, I was wondering why we had his name in the title. I I always said like Otto um I've always been interested in like Otto as a character. I've been really interested in like his whole perspective and backstory. Oh, is it their, uh, his parents? Oh, Otto's left-handed. Yes, but what does it say? I don't know. It, it, there wasn't a translation for that. So I think someone in the comments would let me know. Sick. 
spirit. Ah. Interesting. Keep it to yourself. Yep. Don't blab about it. He's gonna he's gonna say He's gonna pretend like he's crazy. Oh, no, no. Oh All right, so I'm guessing these Zoda bugs or whatever they are, they do something to people. It looks like that looks like Puck. Eighth? Well, I mean, she's a salute. You need to out, you need to, you need to let them know. She ain't nothing but a bad bitch. <laughs> Not in a good way. <laughs> I thought the I thought it was gonna be a little bit different as to like why he got out just just from the very beginning, but it turned out differently, like his whole situation. Oh you this bastard <laughs> It's been a while since I've heard that voice. And it's going to use the animals to save him. Is that... The, I believe that's the same cave where... Uh, we saw Ram play Twister. Um, it might be. I mean, it's a cave, so... Oh, hey! It's that... Oh, crap. Um, That's part of that one girl's faction.
he didn't even realize he was in the, he was crying. Oddly enough, like the um the cult didn't actually kill him. I would have expected him to be like almost killed. Cuz they're cultists and they're weird like that. Mm. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm assuming he's gonna transform by that time. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Why are they playing the intro music? You're not gonna kill off Otto, are you? You were not. I've seen the trope where you get a large amount of background. No, you're not gonna do this to me. No, 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 no. No, you're not. For the love of God, you better not. And please tell me this is just my, uh, me not realizing. And just, please tell me I'm wrong. I don't, I, I don't want to be right in this case. I really want, want to be wrong. <laughs> Hope I'm just thinking of thinking of it. Oh. <laughs> God damn, Ram. Right? <laughs> I mean, I've never made tea, so now give me coffee. I got you. 
He'll always do. <laughs> he does have <laughs> only good timing. <laughs> <laughs> oh god oh, I, I, was, I was waiting for him to actually transform you just ripped up all your nice clothes they weren't really nice but made the kick I mean, if you think about it, she's very small and nimble. Kind of a counter to a big hulking dude. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> you said a motherfucking JoJo reference? <laughs> oh! What'd he do? Oh, man. Otto, I'm still believing. Okay, this is, yeah, because I was curious, because, yeah, at the very end of the last episode... Can get some reconciliation. All right, so that's the first half of the episode. Well, first part. That you ran away. The dudes a dudes in love with you. <laughs> and the I know you're gonna say it. Are you going to say it, Subaru? You're going to say it, aren't you? I have a feeling you're going to say it. It's a perfect opportunity to say it. Is it is it cliche? Yes. Is it a trope? Yes. Do I love, love absolutely every second of it? Yes. I still have a feeling there's there's got to be more to Puck. There's got to be more to Puck about that whole situation. Calling it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it.
or is, she, is he like trying to like force her into a corner? It all came from the very first episode. You know, I still expected him like to at least say why he left. I don't think he really expressed himself as much as right now to Amelia. She can't really... But no one is. They really gave a really good shimmer to her eyes about emphasize the crime. He's a selfish man. It's just like the bickering back and forth right now. It's 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 a little bit hard to read the room. Why? Million dollar question right now. I want to know your response. This is how you end.
makes sense of why she would think that way. And I love how like they're always showing that her she's he, he she's the one in in his eyes. No way. Really? Really? Oh! Sorry, Zoom, it's not the first time this has happened. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I got a kiss from the girl I love. I can do anything. <laughs> So I know we're going to get the reason why he left later on. Oh, well, I mean, unless it was the whole, like, they did all this just so we can get time just for this. I just wonder if there's more to it. Find something that's gonna make you, yeah. I'm really liking this ending. Is this the new ending, by the way? It's not the new ending name, is it? This is going to be a really good, like, character arc to drive forward for Amelia because of this. Oh. That last shot, though. Did you? No, you did not. Did Please tell me. Okay, you just got away from them, right? You better not. No, I. We are not getting a reset. We're not getting a reset. No time soon. Okay, so I'm hoping my my prediction that the whole like the whole auto thing is just a prediction, and I was just thinking too much into it. But they, it, it, there tends to be a trope whenever you get a large amount of background and a lot of uh, backstory just introduced to a character, right? That we've seen for a while now. They're usually... That's a death flag. And you know how much the show is willing to do death flags and actually partake in them. So, I was a little bit hesitant because I do realize that you he can't reset from this. He cannot reset from this. Not at all. So much has been built on this life. Um, and so much big things. And that's like I know it's not going to reset. I'm just trying to figure out what the game plan is, because, like I said, he still has to worry about the mansion, I believe. It's probably going to have to start worrying about it next episode. So, if you think about this, this is still on day two, I believe. Yeah, this is on day two. Next day will be the attack. So, does, Super does have a lot of time, but I do think that him setting up Amelia with this kind of mentality now will help her pass the trial so therefore the sanctuary is set aside and they don't need to worry about the sanctuary now he can go on to um now he can go on to that mansion after this i wonder if he's going to get garfield's help i'm really wondering if he can do that i'm really curious i'm assuming ram and Otto are now basically taken out of commission i'm just really curious as to see 
what's going to happen. And I think this is also really, it was a really big thing on Otto, like how how much of a, uh, uh, it shows just why Otto was so just willing to help Subaru with everything that's happened. Um, and the fact that he would risk his life multiple times as you saw on, di on all the other uh, resets he did. Just crazy. But anyways, I'm going to go wrap this video up. I got to watch The Promise Everland after this. And yeah, I'm going to go be talking to my roommates because he was actually watching it <laughs> as I was watching this. And we'll be able to bounce out some, some ideas. So anyways, what did you guys think about this episode? Like I said, I think at the very end, um, unless there's something more, there's more to it. Um, the fact that Subaru left was to set this up to make sure this happens, this conversation that he had, so he, he could at least, one, get his real feelings across again. But also maybe kind of to give Amelia, back, like, this confidence boost. And just awareness, I guess, for lack of a better word. But anyways, guys, let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.